Dr. Bates is a, is a legend in both uh, clinical medicine and public health in Arkansas. Uh, there's hardly anyone in either of those two fields within our state who does not only know of Dr. Bates, but also uh, hold him in extremely high, high esteem. Dr. Bates is, is very much of a Renaissance man. Um, his perspective on things is very broad. Uh, there's a term that's used a lot in uh, academic medicine now and academic health, um, translational, uh, where you're taking things from the laboratory to the bedside to the population overall. And Dr. Bates has done that throughout his life. Overall, great guy with a tenacity for determining what the problem is, how to p potentially solve it, and more importantly, how to prevent it. This tenacity led to the, the title of Joseph Mad Dog Bates. He has mellowed considerably during the years, uh, and in fact, I seldom hear anyone except the old codgers like myself who remember that he had that nickname early in his uh, career. Joe came to the department um, having already been very involved through our tuberculosis program, uh, but when he came, he realized that there was a lot that needed to be done in terms of improving the scientific quality of the department. And he almost single-handedly really brought us from being a largely bureaucratic organization to being a science-based, evidence-based, academic public health department. Well, he very early was uh, interested in the prevention of disease as opposed to just diagnosing the disease and treating the disease, purely a clinical endeavor. Dr. Bates really had this passion early on for uh, creating a college of public health here in Arkansas. Um, he was one of the primary leaders in a very small group of people who fought many years before the tobacco settlement uh, to establish a college of public health because he knew that we needed that college to do the training of people in public health practice. Dr. Bates uh, really trained a, a good portion of the physicians who are in practice here in the state. And so you start from that, uh, that platform. Anywhere you go, you, uh, you encounter physicians who know and were trained by him. Uh, he also has very, very high professional standards, um, and, uh, and he tends to hold those around him to those high standards, so uh, he brings out the best in people. Congratulations, Joe. Um, this is an award well deserved by you. Congratulations, Joe. I know this is one of many awards, but each one is special because you are special. Congratulations, Dr. Bates.